Okay guys, I'm gonna measure, or attempt to measure, my end, my shimming for the case, the four, the four speed gearbox here for my Beamer. Um, I got the covers here, I got my shims in place, I'm gonna Mickey Mouse this a little bit, but it's all I got to work with. Um, I got a caliper that's only measured in English. So I'm gonna have to do the math and then do the conversion later. Okay, this is, here's my tool, it's only set in inches. So first off, I'm going to go down in and measure Let's see, get glasses here. We got 0.458. That's 0.458. Okay, let's try it in another spot. Looks about the same. That was like 0.457. That one's way off. Where is it? There? There it is. Oh, that's curious. That one comes up 0 0.69. 0 0.469. Huh? Maybe that's part of my problem. Maybe this case is all messed up. Let's try it a different way. We'll get it nice and square on there. Point. 0.74 Oh boy, the mystery thickens 0 0.74 0 0.474 oh, Let's do it this way That's flat 0.477 And this one here That's way off. That was point four three or something. Okay. Come on, square it up. That's just something not right on that section here. Lay that over flat. Push this down. How come it doesn't want to go where I want it to go? Point four six two. Four six zero. Oh, okay, I'm gonna. Covers point four six four to point four seven oh we'll call it that rough guess and then we'll do the the output side point five four two Guess we're never going to make it to National Geographic this way, huh? Point five four five. What? Point four. Point five four eight. Okay. Point five four eight. So we're gonna call this point five four four. Just rough roughing it in someplace in the middle. Okay, so that's the cover measurements. Now here's where I got a Mickey Mouse in. 
over here I got the shims in place I'm just gonna slide them off and slip them out of the way and because I don't have anything I'm gonna brace this cross here and do essentially the same thing as I did on the cover to the top of the bearing oh, I gotta do it this way push down here still not high enough push down here and where we got 0.512 all right plus 0.512 yep I'm gonna put them in the wrong spot this is the cover this is the bearings When I say 0 0.512, two plus the thickness of this thing, which is what? Let's do it right-handed. 0.512. Point oh five two is my square thickness. Point oh five two. So the bearing height here plus that should tell me how much space coming up into the cover subtracted from the space in the cover should tell me how much shim I need. Well, at least that's the theory. I don't know if it's going to be if it's going to work or not. This one's not, I can't get close enough, huh? Okay, so that one's gonna be a problem. Let's try it, let's try it this way. Now this one's leaving me room for error. Lots of room for error. I'm trying to balance it flat onto the case surface. You can tell when you when it feels flat. down to here and this being what? 0 0.406 got it? okay 0 0.406 and the last thing to measure is my actual shims now for my lay shaft the existing shim is 0 0.023 0 0.023 and for the output shaft got 0 0.011 Okay, so I got to go do the math. Talk to you later.